There's a handful of stately homes in this neck of the woods, but the one I'm looking for is one of the few that's still privately owned. It's been home to the Giffard family since they moved to England from France centuries ago. Well, the pressure was you didn't want to be the first one to sell it. But we always said as a family, if you have to, or nobody wants it from within the family, then you've got to bite the bullet and sell it properly and sell it for the best you can. Hello, John. How are you? Yeah, good morning. How much land do you have? There's 4,000 acres here. Come on in. <clears throat> it's quite a haul, isn't it? Yeah, quite a haul. So your family have lived here for how long? 846 years. You must feel an enormous responsibility. What I've done is I hope improved the house. What my father did, I mm. hope improved the house. He did the wiring, I've done the roof, and the next generation can do the heating. This is our saloon. And it's got a massive dome. What do you call that, a dome, cupola? Yeah, no. Definitely a dome. How do you change the light bulbs? As it happens, but it was difficulty. <laughs> John took over Chillington Hall from his parents when he was 45. To earn a bit of cash for the estate, the house has been open to the public for regular viewing since the 1960s. One of John's jobs growing up was to operate the kiosk. He still gives personal tours to this day. This is a scroll of some sort, presumably. It is. So this depicts the pedigree of the Giffard family. Would you like a closer look at it? I'd love a closer look at it, yeah. We might need a bit more room. So what time scale does this cover, then? How, what, where do we start at the far end? We start end? about almost 800, 900. OK, so pre before pre the family came... Back in France. Yeah. In and we case. get up to... About 1700, just after 1700 here. Wow, so there's nearly a thousand years of, yeah. of history here. Keeping Chillington as the family home will be a challenge for the Giffard generations to come. It'll need a loving hand to preserve or modernize and is a huge responsibility. However, there are some new kids on the block who'll soon be taking over. John's son, Charlie, his wife, Tess, and their children are about to move in as the older generation downsized to a smaller house on the estate. So you are the next generation who are going to take on the... We are. ..the house. Yes. Next two. Yeah. Hopefully. I can only wish the Giffards well for the next 800 years, but keeping this huge home going will be no small task.